Did you know you can create your own formulas and functions in Excel? So in this scenario, I actually have a function named after myself and it works and performs the calculation. Let me show you how to Woo! do that also. The lambda function actually helps you to create your own function too in Excel. If I call on the lambda function equals to lambda, you can see it says create a function value which can be called within formulas and it has two arguments, parameter or calculation. So let's say for example, we want to have a parameter called x, comma, and another parameter called y. And the good news is that you can have as many parameter as you want then let's stop with these two parameter for example now i'll bring in a comma then i need to provide the calculation i want to perform for this parameter take note the parameter doesn't have to be x or y it can be a name an animal or whatever you want to name it can be chelsea man you just name your parameter anything you like but in the calculation parts I'll open the brackets i also mention same parameter back so let's say our calculation should be x size y just starting simple then close the brackets close the brackets one more time and hit enter we're going to get this calc error no worries it is actually working so to show you that it is working I will come into the formula bar, open a new bracket, and actually say my x should be 2, comma, and my y should be 4. So expect x times y should be 2 times 4. We're expecting to have 8 there. Hit enter. You can see we have the result of 8. So that's how simple lambda is. The bad news is that it's actually uses like this in a cell. If I hit enter, all I have to do is just come back here, copy the O function, go to C, go to the formula tab under the name manager. I'll create a new name. So I will have to give it a name, but let's paste the formula first there. Delete that and actually paste that formula that we created. I'll come back here and give it another name let's give it big calculation big calc I actually name it anything you like that's the essence of it i can also give it a description this is my first function in excel you can name it anything you like you can also provide it to be in this workbook or audio workbook we have within the sheets you have open if i click on ok you can see it's created a name manager called big calc and i close that so i come back here and equals to big calc you can see it shows the description this is my first function in excel can you do that you have to do to have two arguments x and y all you have to do is just provide those two arguments then let's say my x is 3 comma and my y is 10 so we are expecting 300 so that is the calculation we created and see we have 30 oh nice 10 so we have 30 except i use 100 and we have 300 because it's now that's how simple lambda is now in this scenario we have a let's create a single parameter lambda if i come here and type equals to lambda and say my parameter is x just one parameter and the calculation i want for x should be x times x then close the brackets close the brackets hit enter you get this calc error all we have to do is just copy it out of here onto x this time around i go to the name manager create a new name let me just paste my formula first i can call it multiplication and name is something cool multiply any number so if I, if I want to have a long name for my function i have to put it in in under quotes and say this function multiplies any number by itself that is a good description for our function i think that's cool and say close it if i come back here if i want to perform any calculation in my worksheet all i have to do is just call on my function multiply you can see it's a multiplying number and i just have to provide point to a cell this time around hit enter and boom you can see it works fine just like that we've created our own function within excel now that's quite simple right and you could argue that why would i create a function just to multiply when you can actually use building function or operators within excel to perform simple multiplication wait a minute now let's take lambda a little bit advanced let me show you some cool stuff we can do with lambda now in this scenario we actually have an if function that is pretty long and it's only categorizing this amount column into small expenses moderate expenses and large expenses if the numbers in the amount column actually meet any of these criteria so the goal here is to use lambda to actually shorten this function and make it much shorter and simpler to read all i have to do is just come to the formula tab here and just copy the o function formula from here so i'll create a lambda for it so equals to lambda so my parameter should be x because we actually have one single number of amounts in each cell there comma now the calculation will now be if i'll paste that if hold on i have to change this my reference to this number i'll change it to my parameter x so i'll have to do is just come here and type that edit that to x this to also x this also to x and finally this also to x then i close my brackets hit enter same scenario we get the calc error then I, all i have to do is just copy this whole formula from here let me just copy it out cutting it i go to the formula tab name manager and i create a new function first thing paste it we have it there let's call it categorizing let's say we are categorizing so let's call that function name categorizing so we can give it any description you like let's click on ok and we are good to go all i have to do is just come back here equals to categorizing you can see i can see the function i'm going to my word to my amount column here hit enter and boom can see we have same have same Woo! results using a longer function and using a shorter lambda function so that is one of the ways you can actually use lambda to make longer formulas shorter easy to read and faster to use the idea is that if you have pretty long formulas that you make use of every day you can actually lambda it and make it shorter i hope you found this video useful Do not forget to support the channel by giving this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button put on the notification bell so you really also know that i drop new content like this in excel and data analytics and i go live on my channel also if you found this useful give it a thumbs up follow
follow and subscribe for more.